Today, though, uh, for the nightcap here, we now have the uh, multi-threading has been rolled out for DCS in its first iteration. So this is really cool. Today, we're going to go ahead and uh, and check it all out, to be honest with you. All right, here's the real test, though. Let's jump into a multiplayer server. Look how packed the servers are. I mean, it's a Friday night. However, the open beta dropped and everyone is, look at this, almost every server is at capacity. That's amazing to see. So um, we'll just jump into, I'll just jump into for you. And it's busy enough. So this is gonna be a real, a real test right here. Now I'm looking at my my Ryzen thing here. I mean, the core, the cores are being worked. I, 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 I can't say that I've looked at it before, the multi-threading, but I'm looking at it now and they're all fired up. Dude. 130, 100, okay, it's bouncing around, but we're north of 100 frames. Yo, this is such a, I'm blown away. I mean, we're in a multiplayer server on the flight deck. There's a, there, you know, there's a player taking off right there. I have not had over 100 ever, and I got, you know, my, so for context, I got a Ryzen 5900X, uh, 12 core, 24 thread C CPU. I got a 3080 Ti, 32 gigs RAM, you know, everything's on SSD uh, M.2 drives for, for the games. Oh my God, look at the frame rate. All right, let's get in the air. Let's load up some stuff. We'll just do some air to air real quick. We'll see if it holds once, once we're in the air, you know, and we get, around, we get around other people and stuff. And I've only ever had 40, 50 frames on these multiplayer servers. I remember before I would look at the cores and some of them would be asleep. It would just say, it would say sleep. So like, Maybe they weren't being utilized. I I am in disbelief. We went up 50% increase easily on our frame rate. That's just us on the deck. I mean, this is this is pretty intensive when you're in a multiplayer server on a flight deck on the, with the uh, animations and all this stuff. So let's go ahead and get into some combat and, and then we'll really kind of see what's going on here, you know? We're still holding, man, north of 140. I mean, 140 dabbled in the 130 or so, mid 130s here and there, but otherwise, I, I mean, I've been seeing this uh, FPS, and hopefully you guys can see in the top left corner. Um, it's been, it hasn't dropped below 130, holding mostly in the 150, 140 range. And prior to the multi-threading, I promise you, I would be stuck at 40, 50 tops FPS. Everything is smooth. I, like, it's a noticeable difference for me. Now, this is going to be a varied experience depending on your hardware. It's not like it's not a lot of people on right now. Like, the server's packed, dude. I am. Hey, Eagle Dynamics. Well done. Well done, guys. Hell yeah. Bravo. This is definitely definitely a quality of life experience you know ed has said that this is their first iteration of multi-threading so they're going to be refining it over time um but this is off to a great start i mean this is over 50 percent increase in frame rate for me and my build all right let's take a look here so now we're on the ground we're on it we're in an airfield where there's a lot going on and our frame rate is Dropping as low as 57, 60, 61. Okay. But that's actually still better than when before multi threading, because I would still be at 40 and 30, even in a busy area like it is right now. Like a lot of aircraft and everything. This is still a, a, a better than what I've experienced. Grammy 69, uh, Flight of Two, outbound makeup. All right, rolling. Trying to get a couple of uh, bogeys on the ground. Bro, don't pull out. Don't pull out. He's about to get ran over. Oh, he just got missed. He just. My man wanted to risk it for the biscuit. All right, so we're back in the air. We got frame rates. Okay, 100 plus 111. And again, if you look in the map where we're at right now, I mean, there's a lot of other players, um, but still a significant increase in frame rate and performance. I mean, I'm getting 140, it might dip to 110 so far, but I mean, it's north of 100, which overall is a, is a big dub for me. 
substantial frame rate performance increase. His buddy's hot on me. Trails, trails on me now. Fox three. Making love. Turn it back in. Splash one. Got another bogey coming in. Uh... Where are they at? Where are they at? Hot on me. Lock. Fox three. Going defensive. Ah, this ain't gonna be good. Where's he at? F-18. Is that him right there? Turn it back in to re-engage. Who's the D right there? Box three. Boy, this is getting hectic, boys. Getting hectic. So we're in the middle of a dogfight. Well, not dogfight, but we're in the middle of air combat. And I mean, the frame rate's holding up. We're north of 100. Splash one, splash one, turning back in. I lost the lock. God damn it. Where'd he go? Do you have the radar? No, he's still around. Box two. Hold that. It's down. You know, when, when you have a situation like this, it just means I'm, I want to play more, you know? Like, I just want to play more because it's so smooth. I mean, it is noticeably different. It's like a whole new game. Are they turning hot on me yet? Yep, they're hot on me. There we go. They're on me. Son of a bitch. Go defensive. You got one more on me. Man, shit, they're closing on me. These are fours, boy. They are something else, huh? We're going for it. Why not? Got one. Where's the other one at?
Intel just in. Bomber spotted taxiing from Anapa. Take out this aircraft before it reaches its target. Fox 3? This guy's gonna come down on me like a rain, rain fire. See something up here. There he is. Come here, little shit. Splash two. Woo! Let's go. That was fun. We had uh, five uh, five kills, and we didn't die. So something to notice is we're getting closer to the airfield where there's a lot of other players. I mean, our frame rate's coming down. Still, It's still high. I mean, 80, it's still north of 60. I, I look at it like if it's north of 60, that's a dub for sure. That was a hell of a flight for sure. Just generally an overall better experience in uh, multiplayer. Um, you can see now our frame rate's in the 50s, drops to the 40s. I mean, we're in the middle of the airfield there's a lot of the players ground units and stuff but that seems to be the low end whereas before that was normally where i'd sit at in a, in a situation like this i'd come to you know you'd see frames drop to 30 and stuff you know so really happy with this experience man multi-threading definitely about to change the game for a lot of people now of course the big the big thing here is that it's dependent on upon, upon your hardware so uh you know uh, if you have a newer end higher-end computer build you're gonna probably see the benefits right away 